MailChimp templates tutorial for beginners how to use and customize email templates on MailChimp. Hello guys, Celia here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we easily interact with email templates on MailChimp. So here we are on MailChimp.com, let's go to our dashboard to start creating a new template to start I like working with our email campaign so here we are let's click on create go to creation area and we'll open like email uh, menu and as you can see we have like regular plain text and template and if we'll click on template uh, we'll basically come to our uh, templates area where we can find them so let's click on get started and from this page here we can simply find three folders layouts themes and code your own what's the difference layouts provides us the opportunity to work with empty uh, templates so for example on the featured we only have like structure for sell products mail make an announcement tell a story follow up or educate we can easily view every single template so if you click on this icon in the right top corner of the template we can simply find how does it look like so for example make an announcement uh, like layout template has a title some photos here some text some more text like button and the footer so basically nothing hard and all we need to do after we'll start using is just to fill all the gaps fill this uh, like photo uh, input text as you can see every single uh, email template on MailChimp is totally responsive so it's available on desktop and mobile and it's pretty cool and in this case we have a lot of different layouts uh, like with photos also like with some content and all of them are different in their structure we have like one column here one and then two columns in this template for example which is pretty cool so if you are interested you can just simply come here and try to find something which is suitable as for you of course we have like even a simple text a template as for email so basically this is the first folder on the other folder is like themes and from this page here we can find a lot of uh, templates which are not empty they have like content inside and sometimes it's easier to interact with uh, these uh, with these templates while customized so you can uh, try to maybe find some ideas try to find some text and so on so also there are a lot of uh, different categories we can find them in the left side so we have featured uh, we have e-commerce templates we have like events we have holiday also like newsletter and so on so we can also view all the templates by simply clicking on this button here in the right top corner and if we'll click we'll find how does it look like and as you can see it looks like this so it may take a little time until everything is like downloaded so let's wait for a little i don't think this template looks like this so let's try to view it once more for example this one so if you'll click uh, we can find that this template looks like this, which is pretty cool, you know. Uh, and I think that if you're like easy, it's easy, easy for you to work with uh, their editor, you can easily try to find the idea from this template and you can adopt it to layouts where you can choose this structure. So this is a way. And the last folder is like code your own. It means we can easily paste in a code to be wrote. We can import HTML or import zip. So it's like for programmers, if it's not that hard for you to write your own code to uh, add some styles and so on. So you can easily try to paste in code. But as for me, themes and layouts are the easiest ways to interact with our like templates on MailChimp. But uh, one thing which is really important is that uh, basically you cannot use these templates if you have like free version. You need to upgrade it to the at least uh, the first paid plan. So if you are going to hover on this template, for example, we can find that there is option to start free trial. We don't have option to, uh, you know, use this template. So we need to click and then we will discover the paid plans. And as you can see, we have like a free months. Uh, basically for free and then just it's like 
uh, 12 euro per month so if it's suitable as for you you can easily buy it but as i already said every single template we can repeat it in, in the layout so we can easily use like a uh, layout and then just try to add the make it the same as a template it's a little bit harder but still available and moreover even like these templates or not uh, free so for example from basic we can only use one column for free and one column full width and other ones are only for like paid plan also like simple text is free and for the featured we have only two of them are available on free plan and the others are only for paid plan at least the first paid plan and if you're going to click on any template which is available we'll come basically to our editor and from this page here uh, we can easily interact with every single element so as you can see uh, firstly we can add anything by simply drag and drop right up here for example and the box text was successfully added in this case we can interact with every single object we can for example click on this logo here and all the properties will appear so we can replace make it link add the alt text so let's try to replace for example our logo is this t-shirt so we can just simply add it right up here uh, moreover we can work with these elements we can delete we can duplicate we can add like some AI things and if you'll click we can also uh, resize it for example we can do some other stuff so this is a way of how can we interact with different objects for example with this text here if you'll click we'll find these properties so we can hover we can make it bold italic we can change the size if, if it's necessary also we can change like uh, color of the text and so on so there are a lot of options we can easily do with this stuff and in this case all we need to do is just to um, you know customize every single element this text here this button here so if you'll click on this button for example we'll open uh, these properties where we can add change the button text where will it link to for example to the email address to maybe anchor link or to file sometimes it could be really helpful so here we need to choose all the necessary stuff and then uh, after then everything is ready basically our template is ready to uh, is ready to work with so we can for example save this template by clicking in the right bottom corner on save and exit so now we can name it so let it be like template one for example we can just simply click on save and uh, after that our email template available on our like campaigns and email templates so as you can see it looks like this so from this page we can create campaign with this template preview export as html share and replicate and also we can continue editing by simply click on edit so basically this is a way of how can we work with email templates on mailchimp Hope guys this video helped you out. If it is, please leave a like, comment and subscribe. I wish you a very good day. Goodbye.